Today, I'm gonna show you how to start a blog in 10 minutes. I'll show you exactly how to set up your blog step by step. That will include your domain, your WordPress hosting, and your WordPress blog set up with Bluehost. What's up y'all, welcome back to The Winning Team. I'm Nikisha if you're new. And today I'm gonna give you my recommendations for starting a blog as a beginner. I have been a blogger for the past six years. I currently do content full time. And I, I teach many of my clients how to set their blogs up and get them started as well. Now in this video, I'm gonna be covering the tech side of this setup. So we're gonna walk through the full system and software on what you need to do to get it up and running. But if you want more blogging tips for beginners, check out this video right here. It's a full how to start a blog tutorial and masterclass that walks you through all of the things from how to grow your blog, how to make money with your blog, and all the things you need to know to make this lucrative. So let's go ahead and get into my fast, easy, and cheap way to start your blog with Bluehost. When you're ready to get started, you can head over to nikishawin.com, go Bluehost. You can also find that link down in my description. You're going to end up here on this page with WordPress hosting. Now the WordPress hosting is a bit different than the regular web hosting, but since we are setting up a WordPress blog, this is the best option for that. A few of the differences between the WordPress hosting and the web hosting is that this option is catered for those looking to create WordPress sites. And you do want something that's going to be best for your blog. So I definitely think this is going to be the best option. Additionally, um, it has automated maintenance because you don't want to be doing that yourself. You love for that to be um, done automated for you. It has extra security measures that are specific to WordPress because as you know, there are several security risks that could happen online and you don't want your blog to be compromised. And then also it comes with additional tech support that's tailored to WordPress specifically. So if you need help and you need to reach out, they do provide you with that. So that's the difference there. Um, WordPress hosting is what we're going to to go with. There are, are several options here. You can click on view plans, which will just take you down to this section. Um, and these are all of the things that it comes with. These are all of the features, but if you are just starting your um, WordPress blog, you can just choose the basic option. That's what we will go ahead and do here. As you can see, um, they are running a special right now. If you go ahead and sign up, it's 75% off, which is absolutely amazing. And then at that link in the description, as I told you, you will get um, special rates as well. So make sure you go ahead and do that. But we're going to go ahead and choose plan here and it will take you over to this page that will ask you for your domain name. And so you wanna make sure that you have your domain in mind when you are ready to set this up, know what you want it to be. Um, if you already want the domain privacy and protection, you can click this. And if you already own one, you can click this option, but we're gonna go ahead and get a new one so I can just show you what that process looks like. And the domain privacy and protection, we'll leave that on just for the moment. Let me go ahead and show you how this is. I'm just going to get the domain Nikisha's Notes, and we're going to search for that domain. It then brings you to this page here, basically just letting you know that your domain is available, and it will show you everything it is that you need the WordPress basic hosting here. You can choose the one year option or you even can, you know, choose additional options as well. If you just want to do it on a month to month basis, it's going to cost you more, but you can do that here. And then if you want to go longer, you can choose that here, but we'll go ahead and keep it on one year. And then this is a .com, no additional cost there. The domain and privacy will cost you an additional $11.88. And then you do get that professional email with it as well. So that is amazing. Here are some additional things that you can add. We will not be doing that. We're just going to get the basic setup for now. And then we're gonna go ahead and click continue to check out. And then you wanna go ahead and fill out all of this information here. And let me go ahead and do that now. All right, and once you complete your purchase, you do get this thank you page here. 
and then subsequently it takes you directly to this hosting page and it gets you ready to go ahead and set up your WordPress site and so I'm gonna go ahead and just log in to WordPress and once you go ahead and click on that as you can see it brings you here to this AI site creator which I think is genius that you can go ahead and click this and create a site in seconds I am going to say take me to my dashboard because I'm already familiar with that so I'm gonna go ahead and click there and just have it bring me to the regular page here and as you can see your site is set up and we're in the back end of WordPress. This is where you're going to come to do everything you need to do in your site, set everything up, do your blog posts, all that good stuff. And what you see here may be a bit different on yours because they do switch this up from time to time, but that's okay. The things on the left here will pretty much be the same. As you can see, you have post, media, pages, and these are the primary things that you're going to be looking for. We'll show you how to make a blog post a little bit later. And media here, this is where you'll update any photos or things like that you have. And then the pages, obviously the different pages of your site and you want that to be set up. And we'll do that a little bit later as well. But one of the first things most people are concerned with is what the blog will look like. And so we're going to click on appearance and go to themes. And so as you can see, it has by default activated this 2024 theme and then you can just customize here and then it will take you here to a drag and drop functionality to go ahead and get this set up this theme is not terrible it has some default pictures in here you can change all of this out navigation styles pages all that good stuff that you can do to customize this and make it look the way you want or you can go ahead and just download your own template. I also like paid themes because they just offer so much more customization and personality and just makes it unique to the person. I will link down in the description where I like to get my WordPress themes from, but just for the time being, you can go ahead and just keep this here and customize this if you want and as you can see the coming soon page is being displayed if you want to see what that looks like just click there and it simply looks like this just telling your visitors that a site is coming very soon and so we're going to go back to our dashboard now once you're ready to go ahead and launch your site and everything is set up and you got your theme um, installed and things like that you can simply go here on launch your site and it will bring you to the settings of your blog and you are going to go ahead and turn this off so you just would click this here and toggle it to off because right now a coming soon page is up and you would just turn that coming soon page off but before you do that and make your site live make sure to check your email address because you should have received an email from bluehost at some point after the registration to confirm your email address so that they can just verify who you are and go ahead and get your site up and live for you and now you're all set if you followed me step by step throughout this entire process your blog should be set up and ready to go now don't forget that all of the links are in the description to everything that I mentioned in today's video I'll also go ahead and link out to some other um, videos that you can watch to continue on this process for you as I said I have tons of blogging videos here that I've done and they will be very beneficial to you as you go on this journey again I've helped many clients walk through this process of setting up their blogs and I think WordPress is the best option along with Bluehost. It is fast, it is easy, it's affordable and you don't have to do it on your own because I've helped you through that process today. So if you have any additional questions about this process don't hesitate to comment down below and let me know and I will see you in the next video.